Hello, hello, dears, and welcome to the sunny and gorgeous town of Benidorm in Costa Blanca and Spain. Today we have a special video for you guys. We will be checking the mobility scooters in town. We'll be seeing three different places, three different areas in Benidorm to rent once the prices and we'll let you know what are the rules for mobility scooters and is it actually true that in hotels it's going to be more expensive than in the physical offices let's go first place is located right next to the campsite Rako in Rincon Deloitte and it's MF as rentals and sales and repairs they actually have kind of two buildings this one right here and the other one is situated right here which is supposed to be the main office this is one of the examples of mobility scooter rentals e-bikes or different types of patinets patinetes as they call them here in benidorm rentals of mobility scooters one day 12 euros one week 60 patinet one day 25 electric bicycle for one day or for one week and obviously it's going to be less expensive if you book it for slightly more days or if you book more than two pieces of them spider wheels duo mobility scooter one day 24 euros one week 150 then you also have spider wheels special quads e fat bike which means it's like a fat tire and some other mobility scooters out here are available obviously the more time you rent it the cheaper it will be these are the prices the curious thing about these ones is they say there are discounts for a group not only for a long-term rent and there's one single rule that not a lot of people still know about it but it's very important by law no one under a certain age is able to rent these out usually this is only for pensioners for people over 50s and 60s those who have mobility issues but renting it out in groups unless you are a pensioner retired persons group for younger generations these mobility scooters should not be available let's go to the other place while we are heading towards the beginning of the Mediterranean Avenue in Rincon Deloitte, let me tell you that this place right here doesn't have minimum requirements. Some places do have minimum days of rentals, for example, one day or three days or two days minimum. If not, you're not able to rent them out, but this one does rent it daily too. The thing is that the price is slightly more expensive than if you would book it for one week's stay here in Benidorm town. Today, it is Sunday when we filmed this video. It's the same day when you will be seeing this video from Benidorm town, so it's almost like you would be live in Benidorm by yourselves. And that place was closed, surprisingly let's see if two other places are actually open today and yes we can see it they are we've parked our car here in the private parking spot because there is it's difficult to park your car right now even now in april on a sunday it's quite difficult to park your vehicle oh look at this oh, amigo 24 has opened another office here in rincon deloitte this one is brand new office probably they've not been i've not seen them here at least now it's a new one and it's a slightly smaller office where you can purchase and rent out some mobility scooters so it's a good alternative if you don't want to go up until the market to actually rent something out from amigo 24 and they are the all probably one of the few ones the, basically the only ones that do have agreements with hotels uh, where the hotel reception can actually call the company so that the company would bring the mobility scooter directly for you towards the hotel if you want another company then you would need to actually call them on your own right here nearby in this uh, strange coblanca building this strange building has a lot of different types of businesses inside of it, hidden in the tiniest squares. Here we have some Chinese shops and some interesting bazaars. And right in between, there is Butterfields. This is for scooter sales and rentals. Exactly as the previous place, this one, 
does sell them and rents them out too. These ones are for sale, I suppose. And this place right here opened up around two years ago, maybe three years ago, immediately after pandemics. And Butterfields not only sells, but also rents out different types of mobility scooters. Let's go and check out their prices, shall we? Right here, we can see prices for some sales, 695 euros for a mobility scooter. Then we have something for 700. We have a super sale. Wow, these ones are 1,395. That's, oh, that's like a Mazda one. That's almost like a car. How much a car would actually cost. And this is how close to the beginning of the Mediterranean Avenue it is actually located some more prices 650 we have 750 and some more super sale 750 inside they do have a lot of other types of services for those in need for mobility issues you can check it all out I, they are building official website i think because when we tried and went on it it says it's coming soon so probably they're about to finish it right now these are all that you can actually purchase from this side and then on the other side you have all the mobility scooters that you would be able to rent out as a short term and these ones are for the rent the curious thing about it is that if you take it for one single day it will cost you 25 euros for a single one and 40 euros for a double one however if you start adding days two days already would be 30 euros so 15 euros a day for a small one and the other one would be uh, 60 euros for two days and so on so if you take it for more day more days it would cost you around 10 euros or maybe even less for a day of the rental of these scooters. As in every single company, there will be deposits they will ask you to leave just in case. That's happening in every single mobility scooter rental company. The truth is that you could only rent scooters from more or less one company in the vast majority of the hotels. Others do allow different types of companies and do work with different companies. Uh, and if you want some specific company to book your mobility scooter and for it to be delivered towards the hotel, then you would need to contact the company directly. All the companies usually are able to bring the scooter directly to the entrance of your hotel. And no, the main issue and the main concern of it was, do they charge you more for it? The answer is normally and usually no, it shouldn't be the case. It's true that hotels have specific contracts with some companies, but they do not charge you more for it. They have exactly the same flyers as the ones that we can find everywhere here in the rental companies on the entrance with the pricing. And it's all exactly the same. It doesn't matter if you take it from here or if the hotel books it for you, you will pay exactly the same price, no matter what. Some hotels do try and charge extra for people to charge mobility scooters that are not of the same, com same company they work with. This should not be fair. This should not be correct. And in these cases, well, guests of the hotel that do have these mobility scooters do need to go towards the charging point right at the mobility scooter rental office. Or sometimes if they speak with the hotel, they might let them charge it there free of charge. So it depends on the hotel you will be staying out. And now let's go to the last point, the main office of the oldest mobility scooter rental company here in Benidorm town, Amigo 24, which is situated right in front of the Sunday's market. We are located right now, right next to the Sunday's market. Today is Sunday, obviously, so it's open. And we see some potato men right there. My goodness, look at this. That's how we make money, isn't it? by scamming people don't play it once again we do see some people mostly spanish don't play this game please because that's obviously a scam you will never ever win and you might even lose your belongings so don't do that please be careful starting from now on officially oh look at that my goodness do you see what i see look at how many mobility scooters there are that's absolutely insane how in the world is that possible how from one day to the other benidorm just started to be it's like summer it's like august month right now i've not even seen this busy like this in august as it is right now in april 
Don't tell me it doesn't look like peak summer months. Or am I wrong? This is insane. Scooters parked not only on one side, but on both sides of the pedestrian road. Scooters passing by. Scooters parking. People just sitting on them, relaxing, or just leaving them here parked and heading into the market. This is incredible. The amount of people, look at this, and other mobility scooters. The vast majority of them are rented with Amigo 24, as I can see. We see a lot of logos. And right here in front of the Sunday's market, right next to the uh, restaurant cafeteria fusion, there is the Amigo 24. This is one of the main offices, one of the main ones that we do know. And now there's a second one in Rincon Deloitte. They also do higher sales and repairs, exactly the same as the previous two are actually offering. And here we have some more information on them on which kind of products are they actually using. Double scooters, just a simple mobility scooter, mini scooters as well. Three wheel scooters, electric wheelchair, just a usual wheelchair in case you need it. Electric hoist, toilet rice, seat, commode, shower, chairs and much much more and here they also sell scooters 975 750 800 euros and more these are the prices for the sale of the scooter just in case you need one these are some of the companies you might be able to actually purchase them look at this 500 euros not bad at all isn't it and if you need one this is where you will be able to go full mobility scooter service just in case you're purchasing something or you need it for your scooter like a technical <laughs> like a technical uh you know checkup and then to insure your mobility scooter theft damage civil liability so it's 35 euros the single one for three days that's a minimum period and then 70 is the double one for three days time here in Amigo 24, the oldest company of mobility scooter rentals here in Benidorm town. This company obviously is the one that has the vast majority of contracts that does work with all the hotels or almost all the hotels. They even have their own charges in a lot of different hotel points here in Benidorm, which obviously makes them one of the most popular. Uh, to use here in Benidorm town but as you could have seen there are several businesses that offer more or less the same service we've seen three different companies of mobility scooter rentals here in Benidorm town I'm sure there might be some more but these ones are the most well-known ones the Butterfields that is from a company from UK it's been here slightly less than three years. The Amigo 24 that's been here for decades and decades. And the other company, I do not remember the name, I'm going to put it right here, that we have in Rincon Deloitte. It's absolutely insane. How many scooters do we have here right now when it's market day? It's literally everywhere. They're parked everywhere. That's scooter invasion. Look at this. This here on the right side, on the left side. It's literally every single street here is covered with them. But that's probably because it's the market today. The thing about the mobility scooters actually is you have different types of companies that you can rent these out. Some of them have minimum amount of days. Some of them do not. The uh, cheapest price for three days, obviously, I think it would be Amigo 24. But other companies do have 12 euros, um, 20 euros. It's not as much either. And the deposit is more or less the same. Some companies do have even their own chargers in a lot of the hotels here in the area. Others do not, but it doesn't really cost that much to charge a mobility scooter. It's like 30, 40 cents per night if you leave it charging. So it's not a big cost for you either. You can uh, buy these out as well. You can buy insurances even for them. There's a lot of different options here in the area, especially if you're planning on staying long term, not just on holidays. Obviously, hotels can call the scooter company, but if you want to have a choice of which company to choose between all of these, then recommend you to call them directly. Obviously, they all speak English, uh, not even worth mentioning it because we are an international city and all these companies do speak English and the vast majority of clients of theirs are British and in general English speaking clients. So. Do not worry, they will understand you perfectly. There's even a lot of native speakers working out there. 
so this is what mobility scooters are like this is what their business is like this is what, how much it costs to rent a mobility scooter here in Benidorm town in 2024 and you got to know if it, it's actually true that the prices in the hotels are more expensive than if they are directly at the rental office thank you for accompanying us in today's informative video down the sunny and hot god it's so hot today it's more than 25 26 degrees probably it's very very hot all the people are at the streets having some lovely drinks even in the shade the beach is full as well and this is what mid-april looks like in benidorm town right now and if you want to rent the scooter here in the area or something else you already know where to go and what the prices approximately will be thank you for accompanying us we wish you a lovely day greetings from the sunny and hot benidorm town bye dears.